I guess um, obviously a new coach, mm -hmm. at, uh, position coach there. Talk about that and just kind of what's the spring been like for you? Yeah, no, it's been good. All the tight ends are getting really close, I think. And I think ever since Anderson came in, he kind of just been, it's been really good. Um, he uh, really started like, Bringing the guys together super close, and we're we're really close together, and I think it's been it's been really good so far. As a tight end, I mean, what for you was appealing about staying in Jake Spavel's mm -hmm. offense? Considering I'm sure you came to run wide zone, yeah. pretty heavy tight end involvement. Yeah, that was that was definitely a big plus when committing to Baylor. Is just the involvement that tight ends had and how many he had was specific. But kind of seeing where Jake Spavel all and kind of his offense was going, um, I was able to see how involved they are in the receiving game. And I just felt like that was something that was uh, strong as far as like my game goes. And so um, it was definitely a plus and something that drew me in, so for sure. What's the learning curve been like? Have you enjoyed kind of learning a new yeah. way of things? Or? Yeah, no, going back for offense, it's like going back to high school almost because we ran counter in high school. And so, you know, you come here one ride zone and then right back, to, right back to counter like you did in high school. So it's been a good learning curve, but it's been good because I'm just expanding my talents and expanding my game. So it's been good for all the tight ends. How does this offense differ in terms of how he uses the tight ends? Um, I'd say we're split out more, for sure. A lot less tight ends, but we're definitely put in more crucial positions to do um, the bigger job, I'd say. Um, definitely pulling up and inserting more often towards the linebacker. We definitely have to keep blocks on that. And so um, compared to you know the wide zone styles where we're just running off the line and hitting people in the mouth. So a lot more technique, I'd say, involved. So, But yeah, it's been good. With that change, I guess, how much can you take from last year and what do you look personally to build on this year in this offense? I think just focusing on every single aspect of the game. I think um, when it comes to receiving, working on my footwork, um, working on getting off the ball, not, no false steps. And I think when it comes to blocking, like which step can go first and where I can find the most power, especially from the hips. And so um, just kind of finding every little detail and every single technique or thing that I do and just um, using it to better my game 100%. So. Obviously, with Drake now gone, mm -hmm. does the tight end room as a whole see it as an opportunity mm -hmm. to, you know, take some of that production and run with it? Yeah, no, it's been, it's been hard, you know, no Jake or, or Drake, and so, um, but it's also been really good, new beginnings, and, you know, someone's got to step up, and so um, I'm excited to see where things end up as far as, you know, getting into the summer and um, finishing summer up and getting into fall ball, so I'm excited. Maybe aside from yourself, who has stepped? Trig, Trig came in and started hitting the ground running. I'd say he's, he's been a big asset for the offense. Um, and also Cody Medinka, uh, he's, been, he's been kind of just playing free, I'd say. And so he's grown up and started making big plays this spring. So really proud of him. Yeah, with those two veterans leaving, who do you lean on for leadership? I mean, we're just going to say Gavin since yeah. he's in the room. I was, I was definitely going to say Gavin, yeah. Um, no, Gavin's, Gavin, Gavin's a guy that I can you know, ask when I come to the sidelines or ask about schemes or fronts or something like that. Um, Kelsey, obviously, Kelsey has a lot of experience, and so he's also pretty young, you know. But he's also got a lot of experience, and he's he's a great blocker and a great player. So, got some got some got some guys I can lean on for sure.